Hello everyone and welcome back, if you will. This is now video number three uh, for the snack crate. I'm gonna show it off here. This is the size of the box. I don't know if we've shown the box in any of the other videos, but snack crate, this is our third time. Uh, we're excited. We actually have another one coming soon, very soon. Stuck in costumes, we'll see. But box three. First one was Canada. Had some goods. Had some bads, just like Canada. Uh, that wasn't nice. Okay. Uh, box two was the road trip around the U.S. Mm -hmm. That had some fun stuff, had some, had some gross stuff. But so box number three, we don't know what this is. Um, this is this is a, a raw reaction. So let's uh, open it and let's see. We, what we do get. know this is not the Halloween box we paid extra for. Yeah, we we paid extra for Halloween box. It is now November seventh uh, after Halloween. Well, the issue is that the candies were from different countries. So I think. So much being from so many different places kind of alerted. It's stuck in customs. It's stuck in customs. So maybe we'll get it by Christmas. This box is from India. Oh, uh, that's, that makes me nervous. India. I don't know why if it should. India. But... That's backwards. India. Ooh, this is pretty though. Look at it. That's pretty. Fun facts about India. Martial arts were first created in India and then later spread to the rest of Asia by Buddhist missionaries. Wow. They got some more fun facts. They do speak English in India. Ooh. Official language is English is the first one, Hindi is the second one. So that's kind of, whoa. Six, whoa. Seven, eight, nine. We have 12 things. 12 things. What are we starting off with first? We'll start with these. I think that's what you got excited for. Yeah. So we got Lay's. Lay's Magic Masala. Masala is one of India's most renowned flavors. These chips are bursting with traces of cumin, garlic, and chili. Consider oh. bringing a little mouthwash after indulging in these. Oh, so that when we're starting off. Uh, so definitely with India, you gotta think, I mean, obviously I've never been to India. You probably, I don't think you've been to India before. No. Um, but we have eaten Indian food I love before. love Indian food. So it's gotta, be, it's gotta be a lot of spice. It's hot heat. Chicken tikka masala. Chicken tikka masala is good stuff. Butter chicken. Naan. That's the best. Chana I can. I may need help with this. If I can, my damn finger. I'm pretty much useless. A uh, nice little cooking accident to last Ooh, week. Their nutritional facts. Chopped different. off the fingertip, got it sewed back on. This is so much easier to read their nutritional facts. Are okay. they so long? Can you just open the bag of chips? Were you able to open the bag of chips? No. And don't rush me. I'm not fine. They're sealed weird. What did I do with the scissors? I don't know. What did you do with the scissors? Oh. Okay. Okay. All right. Oh, I can see. Holy hell! <coughs> yeah, they um, you know, <coughs> got some here. Here's some water. Here's some water. Water makes it worse. Yeah, they definitely uh, they dial it up to eleven in India. Holy <coughs> shit! <coughs> I'm going for another one though. <coughs> wow. Oh, they got the little whatever, whatever they, whatever their money symbol is in India, it's right there on the. Oh, they give us a recipe to make naan. Okay, well we'll talk about that later. What's the next thing? Oh, this is gonna be such a spicy box. Excuse me while I move my fresca. I'm gonna butcher this. I'm very sorry. Curcure chili chop, chop, chopka, chopka. 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 It looks by the just by the box, it looks kind of like it's gonna be Cheetos, uh, but it's gonna be corn based, it and then let's got some chilies. I can tell you what they are. Sure. These snacks live up to their name. Kurkur means crunchy in Hindi. The puffed <laughs> rice flavors with spicy hot flavors will keep your fingers orange and taste buds alive. Oh, I've had. I'm, I'm already, tomorrow morning is going to be painful. Ew. I've had <sighs> baked chickpeas, like a snack. They smell like that. Just make sure you wash your hands. Oh, no, you don't have your contacts in. I do I, not. I have to wash my hands for sure before taking on my contacts. That is not as bad. 
not nearly as bad. Okay. It's a different kind of heat. Yeah, the smell is a lot more in your I face. I quite enjoy though. that actually. Okay, well, there's a little kick. There's a little heat on the back end. I, Definitely not in the first bite. The the first the Lay's chip has a lot of heat in the first bite. Not so much on the after effect. This thing, you can feel it a little bit now. The corn chip. For the, spice reference, I am a medium mild human. Yeah, like, human. like for buffalo sauce, I love it as hot as possible. But for spices, spices, I don't know. I get medium with like a shit ton of blue cheese. Yeah, so what is this? Up next, Indian snacks, kati. I thought this said meth for a second. Kata mita? I, for a quick second, I thought it said meth, and I thought we were going to Oregon, a, which is which is legal there now. Shout out to the election. A crunchy, sweet, and sour snack. My mouth is still on fire. This bag contains a mixture of toasted components that will send your taste buds straight to the Far East. So this is you like don't know a, who touched that. You just used your mouth. Whatever. It's been in the box. It's all good. COVID. Whatever. COVID's over. Remember. Um, so this looks kind of like it's an Indian Chex Mix, maybe. There's a couple different things in here. I'm just gonna grab a handful and hopefully not spill this all over the place. Oh, it does look like, ooh, those are very small pieces. Let's see if you can. More trail mix than Chex Mix. Yeah, that's, that's, it's kind of, I'll go for this big piece. That it tastes like chalk. Like that, that is what I'd imagine chalk the consistency would taste like. That's kind of weird. It doesn't help that there's like a bunch of little things in here. Yeah, no. That has flavor to it. There's like corn. No, no, but like the consistency is all like chalk. It's soft. Like, um, I'm trying to think of candy. I don't know exactly what candy I'm thinking of, but. Necco wafers. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's good. I like that. And then they have like these little like stringy things. Like, I don't even know. That's what you did, you old jerk. Yeah, that's all. That's really sweet. They're a little they said sweet and spicy and sour. All right, what's what's taste next buds. here? We get some good reactions. I mean, the first thing was, what in the world? I'm gonna butcher this. I'm sorry. Bujasev, maybe. Bujasev. Crisp uh, basan sticks bursting with traditional flavors such as curry and red chili. So it's gonna be hot. The texture and delightful spice of these snacks strands will leave you addicted. You are the noisiest human being. You bean. open it. I can't do it. Can't do it. I haven't been able to open any of these bags. I don't know what's going on. But one time I used my teeth to open a bag, I get yelled at because we'll make it COVID. Um, no. But you have 10 able fingers right now and you can't open Yeah, but I have no nails. I, I have. Oh, I love the scissors yeah. in the kitchen. Do you want to go get them? No, just. I can't use my teeth because it makes me hypocrite. Yeah. Oh, so it's like some, like the fried noodle sticks you get when you get Chinese food, I think. And then there's one big piece of, what is that? It looks like, so it, you see all the little sticks and then this one little, like what looks like, I thought it was like a weird piece no, of French bread. And then there's literally this one piece. The dried shoestring, like salty, Oh, okay. Uh, fries, I guess, that come in the top. I'm wrong. I'm wrong. There were a couple in here. You it's a that? southern thing. No, like. <coughs> no, like. <coughs> Abort. Abort. <coughs> That's not Ugh. bad. And then there's all these little just. Ugh. Ugh. Yeah, so, so far this box um, has not, not been my favorite. I think now, we have treats now. Yeah, I hope the chocolate gets a little bit better. Ah. Those have been spicy. Though India is definitely a place I would love to visit. I think the culture would be something cool to take in, just the sights. Um, but I don't think I would eat the whole time, so hopefully we can't make it a long trip because this is really hot stuff. You like Indian I like chicken tikka masala, which I don't even know if they actually serve in India. The, that's just like general style chicken, which is, you know, Americanized version of Chinese food. This is called bourbon. I mean, how do you go wrong with Crunchy bourbon? Crunchy biscuits. The... Oh, I just had like a spicy piece to top my teeth and now my tongue is spicy again. Crunchy what... biscuits, yeah, sandwiching, a smooth layer of chocolatey cream, 
these babies have the perfect ratio of crisp to creamy. I can fuck with chocolate, give me up. Yeah. Um, wow. So it's got, it's got some salt crystals on the outside, it looks like, or is that sugar? I'm assuming sugar. It might be sugar. Though salt and chocolate's a good combo. That's a, that's really good. Mm -hmm. I mean, you really can't go wrong with chocolate unless you just take out all of the sugar. But no, this is um, this is number one so far. This is fab. It, it says fab. I'm saving the rest of this for later. That's not getting thrown away. We don't waste food, but sometimes these are also fab. Let's do these. Oh. Fab jamming. So, so do you, I wonder if Fab's, we're gonna have to look that up. Uh, maybe Fab's like a company there. Thin, crunchy cookie sandwiches filled with smooth and creamy fruit flavored cream covered with a layer of jam on top. We've included either orange, strawberry, or black currant. I have a feeling they're gonna be similar like Jammy Dodgers, but they're gonna be different. What the heck is that? It's a British, like biscuit with jam. Ooh. The so they look. Um, what flavor do we have, William? Ooh, I can smell that. that is fucking wrapper. Let me tell you, that's probably bloodhound. Stra it's strawberry. That's that's strawberry. I can definitely mm -hmm. tell just by smelling it that it's strawberry. So it looks. Oh, yeah, it is. It looks a lot like. Oh no, never mind. I was gonna say it looks a lot like an Oreo from this side, like a gold one, but then it's got the. There's like the crunchy crumble. sugar things on the jam. The jam's like really chewy. I didn't think it was gonna be that way, and I mean, I could fuck with this with some tea. Yeah, maybe. It's got. I mean, obviously, just the vanilla wafer part of the cookie is good. It's pretty standard. Nothing, nothing out of the ordinary. The vanilla cream was good. The um, I don't like the consistency of the, the jam or the jelly or whatever it is. It's almost like, um, it's sticky. like a, yeah, it's a sticky, it's like a, I'm gonna say it's like a low quality sugar candy where you really gotta, like it's those dum dum, sweet. like the dum dums I'm thinking, maybe. No, no, those are the lollipops. What the hell am I thinking of? They're over, it's yeah. chewier. It's not like the yeah. consistency of actual jelly and or jam. No, it's, um, it's not bad. That, as she said, it would be good with tea or coffee. Um, mm -hmm. But I don't think you should eat that with coffee. Yeah, maybe not. I don't know. Maybe different flavors. Well, I'd like to try the blackberry currant. I'll keep these for later, though. We have what else do we have here? Um, this is terrifying looking, and it's G for genius. Parley uh, G biscuits. These simple yet pleasantly flavorful biscuits are a staple in India stuff. It's terrifying. <laughs> Flavored with milk and wheat, they if have I, a great nostalgic taste. If I wake up in the middle of the night, it's because that face is haunting me. Be nice. She's doing the Ricky Bobby. I don't, I don't she doesn't know what to do with her hands. Open. I don't know what to do with my hands. Yeah, nostalgic taste. I just thought oh, it is. Oh. oh, there's something here I didn't even see. There you go. I'm looking ahead of oh, so, oh. See, this is just shortbread. You could also eat these with tea. Or probably with her coffee. I don't, I don't really drink tea. I'm a coffee person. I don't She's drink a, coffee. She doesn't drink coffee person. She's a tea person. This is so. delicious. Hobnobs are better, but this is very good. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, you know what that tastes like? An animal cracker. Oh my God, the fucking dog. We're, we're house sitting and dog sitting. Do you want to? No, she left. She left. Is it Coco or Belle? There are Coco. two. Oh, Coco. What a character. I just felt the nose. No, 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 no. Uh, I will not grab the box. Oh, no. Magic's pineapple. I'm already. Ooh, I'm excited. I don't think I'm going to like this. I don't know. But <clears throat> maybe because I love Dole Whip. But I don't like eating pineapple. Um, hot take. Actually, it's really not a hot take. Pineapple does not belong on pizza. Um, if you think it does, say something in the comments. I'll argue about it. But um, I know we're not eating pizza, but it's pineapple, and that's always my first Can I read the description now? Go ahead. Thank you. Crisp biscuits with a creamy, tangy pineapple filling. 
This cookie satisfies all cravings with its amazing balance of flavor and texture. It is the and first one just broke into pieces. I'm trying to take it out of the box. They were BOGO at Publix today. No, tomorrow. They're BOGO at Publix tomorrow. Sundays, fun fact. Okay. I went to the Dole Pineapple Farm in Hawaii. Wow. That was delicious. Oh my God, stop doing that. It's the dog. It's not me. Hands are right here. It's the dog. She's trying to figure out why we're talking or who we're talking to. And it's you guys. It's the people who watch this. No but we have a few people that watch it. We watch it. We do watch it. I know some of my Yankee Twitter people watch it. You know who you are. You know. You know who you are. It is delicious. I don't know. I'm so afraid because I don't really love pineapple. It's the fucking thing. Okay, yeah. Pineapple, Pineapple still, still does not belong on pizza though. That's, I'm just gonna end it there. That will keep, that I like. Um, it's, Note that we're only keeping the things he likes because I have no opinion. That's fine. Yeah. I'm just gonna sit here and drink okay. my first cup. What, what have I not liked that you liked? I like those chata, the cheetah things. I like the trail mix. No, too I like spicy. The, Jammy cookies. Mm. Okay, well, if you want to keep them, we'll keep them. Hey, if you want to throw them away, we'll throw them away. This puppy won't stop trying to get into her lap. What is this? Poppins. Fruit flavored jelly candies that burst with tangy sweet flavor. They also have a unique texture that Indians refer to as pulpy. Puppy. Come here, puppy. This so, pulpy. They're just. How do you like your, I mean, I'm not an orange no, juice person. No, no pulp. Okay, I was gonna say, I'm no. not an orange juice person at all. The smell of orange, the consistency of orange juice grosses me out. I'm trying to pick you up. Stop it. She's just being a little Teeth shit. Teeth are not for. Oh, so we take it out of one wrapper for it to then be in another wrapper. I guess the Indians don't want. This, uh, this is coming off kind of like a lifesaver right now. Is that, yep, okay. So it's a lifesaver without the hole in the center, which they say the, the reason the hole is in the lifesaver is so if it gets stuck in your throat as a kid, you don't choke and die on it. Oh. This is clearly going to be a raspberry type, so I'm going to... Do you want to pop it? I didn't want one, thanks. Well, I was asking you. I you want, want yellow? No, I want yellow. Hey, who likes yellow candy? Not me, not her. Coco. Okay, so we had one red, one yellow. Ah. Not you, Coco. <laughs> red one wasn't bad. We wanted a purple. I do like grape candy. I don't like grapes. I like grape candy, though. What? Boop. Okay. This is What's Coco. That? It's her birthday next week. She'll be one. She'll be a one. She's a derp. She's a derp. But she's also um, a great service, emotional, something or other. No, dog. she has more anxiety. She has anxiety, but she's great. She loves me. Right. She makes me feel appreciated when I hang out with her. Right? Right? Right. She has All a right. sister named Belly who's sleeping, and Belly is the best. Belly's great. Belly's a little bit older. Belly's way over there. Maybe I'll grab her at the end, but she has no interest you figure out why we're talking to the box, which is this iPad, and why we're grabbing food out of a box. On to the next thing, please. Excuse me, Coco. Ooh, come here. Yep. This is where she spends most of her days when I hang out with her, is right here in my arms. Roll the cola. I'll do that. Ignore my nails. Roll the cola. The name says it all. This package contains small, solid cola flavored morsels. It's honestly a huge mind trick if you ask us. So surprise, surprise. Here's another thing I don't really like. I love soda. I don't. I don't drink it. Don't drink it. Uh, something about the acidic just doesn't sit well no, with me. Like bubbles. Yeah, the bubbles. That's not acidic. That's carbonation. Carbonation, acidic, whatever. It's all. Diet Dr Pepper is. They. Damn. They pour Coca Cola 
on blood on the roads to clean it up. Why would anyone want to drink that? It's gross. It's Diet Dr. Pepper. This is the superior soda. Okay. I'm still sucking on this other thing. How do you want me to eat something else? I don't know. Spit it out. Go on to the next thing. Oh, it Give smells it just like it. Uh -huh. I'm not gonna like it, but I try okay. everything. One bite, everyone knows the rules. I don't think that's I don't think that's a catchphrase, maybe. I don't know. Or catchphrase, yes. Copyright. Ooh. That's what I meant. It does taste like Coke. Holy moly. Actual Coke, not diet coke. Regular Coke. It doesn't bubble, you should be fine. Yeah, it's still a weird flavor though. But you like that, so we'll keep that one. I do like soda. We'll keep that candy. And then the little. Well, what's next? So much of little stuff. We'll do those last. Those mm -hmm. are also sucky things. One mm. more thing. One more thing last. One more thing before the sucky things. <gasps> no. I don't know. Cadbury Perk. Cadbury is the superior chocolate brand. Come at me. Hershey's is so processed. Cadbury is a wonderful. Yeah, but last time I checked, Hershey's is an American institution and anything made in America will always be superior. Our chocolate so artificially sweetened. Layers of crispy wafers coated in thick, rich milk chocolate. Each bite has a perfect snap accompanied by a blast of sweet chocolatey flavor. So it's like a, it's a wafer, chocolate wafer. When I was in South Africa, I lived off the Cadbury dairy milk bars. You lived off chocolate milk bars when you were in Africa. Okay. When we're on the road, yeah. Okay. I did eat crocodile and warthog and impala one night. Mm. Which one was your favorite of those foods? Um, before I knew what it was, the warthog was good. Was and then the, they were like, oh, look, this is Pumbaa. It was the first night we got there. And they ordered dinner, our teachers ordered dinner for us. And they wouldn't tell us what it was till after we ate. We'd been flying for like 18 hours and everybody was starving. All right, so um, the wafers taste stale. Yeah. Um, I don't know if it's because of, cut, you know, traveling and getting this from India and coming through customs. If it's stale, if it just expired or if it's just low quality, because it's Cadbury, I don't know. Fuck you. They're, um, they're stacky, though. They're, they're flaky. I don't like the flavor of the chocolate. I do. It's, um... It's, very, it's like a bland chocolate. It's definitely, I mean, oh, ours is artificially sweet, and you can definitely tell it's not sweet enough. You're bland. Joke's on you. You married me. Okay. Um, so... Uh, two out of ten. What are you uh, eating? What does she have? Go get it. What is it? I don't know. I'll be back. Fucking puppy. <laughs> <laughs> She's running around this table. Come here, you little shit. Coco, no. She ate one of my puzzle pieces this morning. Is she done? I think she's done. I think she's done. <laughs> Whatever it was. If it was chocolate, she dies. No, it wasn't chocolate. Whoops. Okay, not chocolate. Then I'm not worried about it. Anything left? Yeah. That was really funny. Okay. These are the same thing. What are these? Okay. They look like warheads. Oh. oh. Kacha mango bite. Gotcha Mango Bite, these candies give you the best of both worlds, sweet with a natural twist. Experience the real and puckering tang of mango that is enhanced with a light sugary bite. Ooh. I'm still eating this cola thing. Well, just, just spit it out. No, There's like a bunch more. It's delicious. It's See. wasteful. This came all the way from India. Who knows when I'll have those again? So you'll have more again, more, because whatever. What? Oh, this is very green. I feel like if this was a ring, it would be like the Green Lantern. It's very green. Well, the outside of mangoes are in fact green. No. I don't like that at all. William doesn't like fruit. No. 
thought they were like fruit. That had a very, I was hoping it was gonna be sour. You, you got me all excited thinking it was Warheads, which was our mistake because it's green. So I immediately thought Warhead and it's about the same size. Maybe a little bit smaller. Um, but that, that taste. It tastes like mango. No. It's delicious. Tastes like. Mango. No. Have you eaten a mango? And how do you know no, what it tastes like? It tastes like that. It was just like I was eating hair or something. It was really what? weird. Yeah, it was it was really weird. You are Don't, psychotic. No, you, you're the one continuing to eat that. It's delicious. You're the psychotic person. So that's India. Uh, definitely, they hit us up with the spice in the beginning, the lace chips. These were good. Hot, but these were good. I liked these. Um, you said you liked. I these, like were, those. these were Jordan's favorite chips. No, and I like the trail mix as well. And the trail mix, which was this one. Yeah. Oh, and now it just goes everywhere. Son of a bitch. We'll have some clean up to do. This one here. Um, the heat was nice. You definitely get that with some of the Indian stuff. The desserts were, were um, some sweet, some were just kind of yeah. middle of the road. I actually surprisingly liked the pineapple. Um, it was guys. authentically pineapple yeah. tasting. It, it wasn't artificial. Yeah, no, that was good. I, I went into it thinking I was going to hate it, but I actually didn't. So that was a, a side relief. Like everything we eat is artificially sweet. This is true. Mm -hmm. um, but I liked the little, uh, little and snack And if anybody design. would like to make non-bread, here's the recipe. Well, I've got a recipe for non-bread. Um, so this is India. We're wrapping up. This is our third crate snack crate uh box that we've done we did canada which was fun it was a fun intro too we did the uh road trip around the u.s which was an interesting one india um different i mean we had I, i'd safe to say we've never had any of this before so i was trying everything for the first time um what do you think what do you think of the box one to ten it's just a six a six that's a fair score it wasn't great uh, it wasn't terrible. I liked more things than I thought I would. Um, yeah, um, there definitely wasn't anything that was like, oh, this is awful. Kind of like with that the Canada box where you had that gum that, that tasted like soap. Was it was awful. A treat. No, that gum was awful. It was very um, refreshing. I nice. actually am going to enjoy these little puffins, toppins, whatever these things are. It's the little lifesaver stuff. Um, so that's it for now. Um, we should be back soon. Hopefully the Halloween box is Coco coming back on. Yes. Hopefully the Halloween box um, will be here soon. And even though it'll probably be close to Thanksgiving by the time we get it, and maybe we'll just do a Thanksgiving edition Halloween box. You want to eat a Halloween box? But until then, uh, take care, guys. Have fun. Hopefully uh, you like, subscribe. I'm just kidding. I don't actually do any of that stuff on YouTube. But um, leave a comment. If uh, anything that stood out that you'd want to try yourself and um, maybe we'll find a link for how you can sign up for your own snack crate and get in on the fun. Again, guys, thanks so much. Say bye, Coco.